Chicago, right? The mayor over there. He's trying to quadruple the taxes to pay for homeless people, okay? And even the big blue wave that is constantly smashing into the Windy City, even they have said enough of this woke liberal agenda. Let's talk about it. All right, y'all. Welcome to the show. Today, we're going to talk about Chicago politics, real estate transfer taxes, the mayor, all right, Mr. Brandon Johnson, and we're going to talk about homeless people, right? Let's get one thing off our chests, right? The first thing I think we should say, because you know what? We're all thinking it. I know y'all thinking it. But not a lot of y'all want to say it. But, like, fuck homeless people, right? Like, seriously. Like, honestly, fuck homeless people. You know what I'm talking about? You're trying to fucking go downtown, trying to go catch a game, and some fucking homeless asshole fucking basically accosts you and harasses you and pretty much threatens your life to buy his stupid-ass rose for, like, $14, right? And if you don't, he's going to shank you, right? Y'all know what I'm talking about. Homeless people fucking suck, okay? And it's not like they got homeless by some weird happenstance, right? They got homeless because they're fucking assholes, right? You know, just a bunch of drug-addicted assholes. So, like, I know not a lot of you wanted to say it. I know it's not the cool, woke thing to do, right? You're not supposed to say fuck homeless people, but, like, seriously, fuck homeless people. And also, fuck Brandon Johnson, right? But what's cool is all the liberals, all the Wokies out there in Chicago, you guys actually finally did say fuck Brandon Johnson. And I'm proud of you guys out there, right? I'm proud of you. So for those of you that are unaware, uh, the measure he had to jack up real estate transfer taxes failed, actually, right? Chicago, as progressive as it is, actually said, dude, like, enough, bro. Like, we, we get it, man. We're woke. We're liberal. Like, we don't say fuck homeless people publicly, okay? We think it, because all all y'all liberals, that's the difference between liberals and conservatives. Like, conservatives, like, we'll say what we mean, right? Uh, Liberals, on the other hand, you guys will say all the right things, but then do none of it in your actual personal lives, and then just try to pass the buck on to someone else, right? Like, you guys are totally down to give as much money as you can to homeless drug addicts until uh, that money that you give to them is your own money. You're down to open up someone else's wallet, but not your own wallet, right? Uh, That's the difference between liberals and conservatives, y'all. But anywho, even all the liberals in Chicago, they had enough of the housing politics, the liberal politics, it's just out of control, right? So for those of you that don't know, bratty boy here wanted to triple and in some cases, quadruple the taxes people paid when they're transferring property, right? So landlords getting eviscerated, right? Anybody who owns property and wants to sell it, this dude wanted to as much as 4X the amount of taxes you already have to pay to pay for a bunch of fucking homeless people who are just chilling, shooting up, right? Like, dude. I mean, I'd lie and say I cared about the plight of homeless people, but I fucking don't. But for those of you that do, uh, these are grown fucking adults, dude. All right? They're making bad, horrible decisions. Uh, you know, we're not responsible for them, okay? Like, you know, all the Wokies out there, you want to cure or solve homelessness? You got some dude out there who would prefer to shoot up heroin than live a productive life like, you know, every other adult in America? And you want to fucking be Captain save a on that guy, go for it, bro. Knock yourself off. Do what you can, right? Ain't nobody here saying you can't give your money and, and, and do what you want to do to help homeless people. But don't you come in here and vote to have the government come and steal money from citizens to pay for that crap. Enough, dude, all right? This overtaxation is theft, and it's madness, and I'm glad 
uh, that real estate owners in Chicago finally said, no, this is a big victory for real estate investors in Chicago because that would freaking crush the housing market in Chicago, right? Y'all want to give money to homeless people? I don't. But if you do, go to fucking church, okay? And fucking give it to your church or do some shit with fucking Jesus and y'all give all the shit you fucking want. But do not come in here with some crazy liberal agenda and try to steal it from other people, dude. It's nonsense. I'm glad to see property owners in Chicago stepped up. What do y'all think? Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.